What's happening people? Welcome to another video with All Souls. Today I'll be unboxing and reviewing this Jackcom H1 Smart Health Watch. Now just before I start, this smartwatch I'll be giving away in my free All Souls 10k special free giveaway. So if you haven't seen that video, you can see it on my previous video and also leave a link in the description box below. As always guys, make sure you subscribe and also hit that bell notification so when I upload any video, you'll actually be notified. So people, let's unbox and review this smartwatch. Watch. What's happening people? So this is Jackcom's first smart health watch, it is the H1. Just before we take a look at the specifications, let's see what we get inside the box. Okay, just before we take a look at the smartwatch itself, let's see what kind of features it's got. So it has 30 day battery life, aluminium full metal body, a 2.5 corning gorilla glass, 1.33 inch color touch screen, IP68 water performance in all cases, and a precise monitoring of the heart rate and blood pressure. And it also says jackcom.com, the website on the side and the bottom of the box. And also this is, uh, you can only get it in a black color as well, a uh, black band and a black fascia as well. On the back, it just gives you a brief introduction of the functions. You've got a QR code, a few details of Jackcom and a barcode right there with some Chinese writing. So let's take a look at the watch itself. Now, as always, what I'll do is I'll connect this to my iPhone and see how easy it is to connect. And I'll just show you some of the features on the phone. Uh, but like I said, if you want to have a chance of winning this phone, check out my previous video where you can uh, enter the free prize giveaway. So taking a look at the watch first thoughts. It has a nice uh, band. These are not interchangeable as well. Uh, you can't slide these out as you can do with the previous one that I have done in the past. Uh, but yeah, it's a black and black watch. Definitely my favorite combination. And uh, taking a look at the back, you've got your sensors for your heart rate monitor and blood pressure monitor as well. Sleep monitor as well. Multi-sport message notification. So you can actually get notifications on this uh, when you actually connect it to your phone. So you're probably thinking, how do I switch it on? Well, if you take a look at the bottom, it does actually say Jackcom. I don't know if you can see it, but if you do win it, you'll actually realize, or if you've got one, you probably know. So all you do is you hold on to the Jackcom and it will actually switch on. As you can see here, it's vibrated, it says hello. And there we have it, people. It does look a similar fascia to a my Fitbit, what I've, uh, well, not actually reviewed. So if you want to see a comparison between this Jackcom and the Fitbit, let me know in the comment section below. So to put it back on, you just actually click the Jackcom, which you can actually see. Oh, I don't know if you can actually see that at the bottom. So you can see, if you can't see that, then it does say Jackcom. That is the invisible button. Right, to use this you have to press the imaginary button, I don't know if you quickly saw it, it says Jackcom right there. So once you actually click it in, it's got the uh, pedometer and sleep monitor at the bottom. So once you click the Jackcom again, it actually says uh, your goal completed from your pedometer. It actually switches off straight away, you've got your heart rate, rate monitor, uh, that's that's your uh, sleep monitor and you can actually um, long press for sport when you're running and you can actually switch it up from there so it has got a few features what I'm going to do is you can actually change all these in the settings uh, there's your pedometer your heart rate monitor I'll just go through all of them again so let's uh, long press for sport let's see what option it has for sport so that actually, you know, if you're running or jogging or walking or whatever, it actually calculates your beats per minute, uh, your calories and your steps. And it also gives you a timer as well. So let's pause that. Exit. Oh, so you have to hold on, hold on to it to exit. So once we do that, and there we go. So you have to long press, also long press to uh, um, uh, switch it off as well. So I don't think this, uh, you know, it has a lot of features, but for a basic smartwatch, it's definitely decent. It's got a nice uh, display as well. So 
taken a look at any slides on the smartwatch it's just at the bottom so what I'll do is I'll connect this to my phone and then I'll show you how it is and uh, then yeah I'll just wrap it up from this but uh, as you can see it's got some flashing green lights at the bottom to check out uh, the ratings of your thing so what I'll do is I'll uh, put this on my wrist connect it to my phone and let's see what kind of heart rate monitor I have and then uh, yeah I'll just wrap this video up from there right i have can uh, put it on my wrist and it has a uh, tilt to wake so which is a good feature let's see if it actually records my uh, beats per minute heart rate the latest one as you can see is 72 but if you have to leave it for a around a few seconds and it will actually kick in from there so that's your heart rate monitor works right there so if you look at the box here it has got a qr code but this qr code is for the uh, instructions if you don't want to read the manuals which you just click the qr code it goes to the website you choose what you have so uh, first choose english uh, choose what uh, product you have you've got a smart wireless car charger p2 smart sports watch you've got quite a few uh, products to be honest i have done a review of the bh2 smart headphones so you can check out if you want to uh, buy any other ones of these so you can i can review then let me know which one in the comment section below so uh, let's go to the top and we have the smart health watch which we have right here my heartbeat is going a bit up as well 99 now so yeah you just enter your email address and they'll actually send you a copy of the instructions so if you want to download the app you have to go into the manuals and there is another qr code right here so let's put this one in and this one takes you to a different website uh, and you just whatever phone you have it actually connects to any android or iphone device so you, i've got an iphone as you can see click to download go straight to your app store and this is the app we need h band so we'll just click that and uh, download that the app is downloaded h band as they call it so i'm not going to allow my not don't allow that no account login Please confirm whether you have carefully read yes confirm definitely read it in order for the bracelet to better monitor your health choose a skin color that is close to your skin wow this is the first ever so what do you think people so we go for this one or this one and we go for this one go for that one so uh, let's do our date of birth and a few other personal information I'm just going to do anything to me. This is not my uh, date of birth, by the way. So let's, uh, and I don't even know what kg I am. So let's just go for 80.5. No idea what height in centimeter they are. So wherever that goes to, uh, there we go. So steps, we'll just do 10,000 a day, sleep. Uh, hopefully I do get eight hours. You never know nowadays. So to t turn on Bluetooth to allow HBAN to connect to accessories so uh, turn all turn all categories on let's do that allow and there we have it people so basically i've not done no steps or anything but that's how to connect it to your uh, smartwatch to your iphone or android device depending on what phone you've got and this will actually monitor uh, any running or sports you do walking or exercise or whatnot you can actually reset everything from here as well you can actually change your personal information hit your goals and everything like that so for your people who have got one or for anyone who wins this on my previous videos for the free giveaway this is how you connect it to your phone so people what do you think of this jackcom smartwatch uh, it does cost around 30 to 32 pounds including delivery depending on whereabouts in the world you are but i have got to say it does look really nice it's a black on black feature i'll leave the plastic on for the winner uh, but yeah i've connected it on my phone i'll reset everything and it's, it'll be ready to go for the free prize giveaway so make sure you check out the link in the description box below and check out the free giveaway video uh, to see how you can enter for this free smartwatch thank you for watching this video guys i will see you again for another video souls giveaway this is the 10,000 subscriber giveaway and uh, i will be doing a 10,000 subscriber special video so yeah like i said in my previous videos make sure you comment below what kind of special video you want to see so in this video today i'm going to let you know how you can enter in my free all souls giveaway and i'm actually going to tell you when i will be actually uh, announcing the winner as well so let's get started